Dear students, today's class we will see the introduction towards trigonometry, one of the important chapter of octal angles. Okay? The chapter name is multiple and sub multiple angle. Today we will see some of the formula that are very much important in optional maths of this multiple angles that is sin 2a formula, cos 2a, tan 2a, cot 2a and so on. Okay? So to understand this formula you should know the trigonometric portions of class 9 compound angle formula. So let me revise that formula of class 9. Okay? So I will write here review. Let us go to compound angle formula that you had studied in class 9. So let us write formula number 1 of class 9. This formula is of compound angle. Okay? You also take a notebook with you and write the formula with me so that it will be easier for you to understand. So one number formula you write formula number 1 sin a plus b equals to sin a cos b plus cos a sin b. Then two number formula you write cos a plus b equals to cos a cos b minus sin a sin b. Then three number formula you write tan a plus b equals to tan a plus tan b upon 1 minus tan a into tan b. Four number formula you write cot a plus b equals to cot a into cot b minus 1 upon cot b plus cot a. Okay? Then you have five number formula, six number formula, seven number formula and eight number formula. Okay? So five number, six number, seven number, eight number formula very easy if you understand or if you know one number, two number, three number and four number formula. Just you see this signs plus or minus. Okay? Instead of plus you replace it by minus and wherever you see minus, you replace it by plus, you will get the desired formula. That is 5 number sin a minus b equals to, now you write here, okay, sin a minus b equals to sin a cos b minus cos a sin b. Okay, now come to number 6, 6 number formula, okay. Six number formula you are going to write is cos a minus b. So cos a minus b equals to cos a cos b. Now what I have told here, you must mention opposite sign that is plus. So cos a minus b equals to, I will write here, cos a minus b equals to, now you write, okay, cos a cos b plus sin a sin b. Okay, now 7 number formula, 7 number formula is tan a minus b, tan a minus b equals to tan a plus, now here is plus, instead of that plus, you replace it by minus, so your formula will be tan a minus b equals to tan a minus tan b upon 1 plus tan a into tan b, ok, now go to formula number 8 and your 8th number formula is going to be cot a minus b cot a minus b is equal to cot a cot b let me write this cot a cot b minus you replace by plus 1 upon cot b plus you replace by minus cot a students maximum students they get confused in this okay Sometimes they write cot a minus cot b, but it is not like that. Okay, when you see the derivation, it will be easier to you. The formula is cot a minus b equals to cot a cot b plus 1 upon cot b minus cot a. Now, 
this all uh, formula from 1 to 8 is formula of compound angle that we have studied in class 9 ok here in class 10 these formulas we use to derive the formula of multiple angle that is why I made you to remind this formula of class 9 now multiple angle I will write here multiple angle formulae ok class 10 one formula we are going to derive so let us see now what you need to see is here very simple derivation this one number formula two number three number four number means this addition formula you just focus ok and here two angles are here a and b now to get the multiple angle formula of class 10 what you do you replace this b by a means if angle a and b they are equal then let us see what happens let us see number one number one can you see sign a plus b is there ok now when a will be equal to b then this is going to be a plus a is equal to sin a cos a plus cos a sin a so this is going to be sin a cos a plus sin a cos a sin a plus a plus sin a cos a is equal to 2 sin a cos a so class 10 multiple angle first formula is this one for you that is sin 2a equals to 2 sin a into cos a ok actually there is not only one formula of sin okay? in terms of other trigonometric ratios we can express the formula ok so how that can be let us see here students can we write like this all upon 1 ok this we can write like uh, 5 we can write 5 upon 1 same thing isn't it now this 1 1 I shall replace it by cos square a plus sin square a ok cos square a plus sin square a now what I will do I will divide this numerator and denominator by cos square a let us see what happens when I divide by cos square a this cos square a ok then you will get you will get let me let me show the derivation here if I divide by cos if I divide by cos square a then you will get like this ok now here you see cos a and one of the cos a gets cancelled so what is left 2 sin a upon cos a is tan a ok upon now see this separate this if you separate this then cos square a upon cos square a you will get 1 you know this and sin square a upon cos square a you will get tan square a. so this is the second formula of sin 2a in terms of tan a so sin 2a equals to 2 tan a upon 1 plus tan square a. now in terms of quad a we can get very easily ok just you convert this tan a into quad a and what is the relation to convert tan a into quad a tell me tan a equals to 1 upon quad a if you, if you just uh, write here tan a instead of tan a 1 upon quad a then you will get this formula 2 quad a upon quad square a plus 1 ok so this is these are the formula of sin 2a that we apply in the problems of class 10 multiple angle chapter ok so sin 2a how many formula you have studied today 3 formula sin 2a equals to 2 sin a into cos a sin 2a equals to 2 tan a upon 1 plus tan square a and sin 2a equals to 2 tan 2 cot a upon 1 plus cot square a ok students you also write this in your note copy so that will be easier to you to study later on let me clear the board now ok you copy this now let us go to the formula which I will get in terms of cos 2a. I will write here two number formula cos a plus 
a as i told you earlier replace b by a then you will get cos 2a okay now i'll write that little bit uh, directly okay so cos 2a equals to this, let's see here on the board cos a cos b minus sin a sin b will be cos a cos a minus sin a sin so it is equal to cos a square a minus sin square a this is the first formula of cos 2a okay now the same formula again can we write denominator 1 very easily we can write now instead of 1 we replace it by cos square a plus sin square a okay now again again what we have done earlier in sin with here we will divide by cos square a when we will divide by cos square a and separate then cos square a cos square a gets cancelled then 1 minus sin square a by cos square a is tan square a okay then cos square a by cos square a is 1 plus this is sin square a upon cos square a will be tan square a another formula of cos a in terms of tan okay now uh, let me again clear this I will uh, make this right uh, later on okay so let us see the formula of cos 2 in terms of cos a also so this was the formula okay so cos 2 equals to cos square a minus sin square a now what do you do change this sin square a in terms of cos square a the formula was taught to you in class 8 if I remember okay so tell me the formula sin square a is 1 minus cos square a okay so cos square a minus 1 minus minus plus cos square a cos square a plus cos square a 2 cos square a minus 1 so this is the formula of cos 2 in terms of cos a that is cos 2 equals to 2 cos square a minus 1 okay you also wrote it down now let us uh, derive the formula of cos 2 in terms of sin a okay so let us start uh, i have here cos square a minus sin square a now what i will do i will change this cos square a in terms of sin square a class 8 formula do you remember tell the formula cos square a means 1 minus sin square a minus sin square a is same we copy now 1 minus sin square a minus sin square a is minus 2 sin square a so this is the another formula of cos 2 in terms of sin square a. Similarly, we can convert this cos 2 in terms of quad also. Uh, earlier I had it done that I will make you to write in a single uh, board. Okay. So, I will write here. Now, cos 2 what formulas we have studied? One number formula cos square a minus sin square a. Let me arrange and write. Okay. In terms of sin, 1 minus 2 sin square a in terms of cos 2 cos square a minus 1 in terms of tan 1 minus tan square a upon 1 cos tan square a in terms of quad if you change this tan into 1 by quad you will get quad square a minus 1 upon quad square a plus 1 so you also note it down this formula first we have 5 formulas are here and it is very very important for the problem solving exercise okay so this I formula you copy in your note copy also. Okay. Now let us go to the formula of sin 3a. Uh, okay. Before sin 3a, let us uh, know the formula of uh, this tan 2a also. Okay, students. So tan 2a. Tell me this 2a how it has come. Only earlier I had told you tan 2a. See here compound angle formula three number. Tan a plus b. B will replace by a a plus a tan 2a equals to tan a plus tan a is 2 tan a upon 1 minus tan square a ok so tan 2a you can convert in quad also quad also you can convert yourself can you replace by 1 by quad you will get the answer ok but generally we use tan formula in terms of tan only so this only formula you today I have made it right ok so let us go to formula number 4 formula number 4 now see this compound angle formula of formula number 4 see here cot a plus b what we will do we will write this cot a plus a that is 2a equals to cot a into cot a that is cot square a cot square a minus 1 upon 
what b plus what a will be what a plus what a that is 2 cot a. So, this is another formula of what a in terms of what a. So, this is formula number 4 you please mention in your copy also formula number 4 ok. Now, let us go to formula number 5. Now, uh, the, the formula we are going to derive in terms of 3a ok angle 3a that is sin 3a. Now, uh, I think uh, you know how to derive this just hint I will give you I will not completely derive here ok. So, sin 3a please see your students sin 3a we write 2a plus a ok. Now, sin 2a plus a means 3a we you suppose as a and this a is b then this formula you will understand you have to copy or you have to use this formula here that is sin I will write here sin a cos b, b means cos a ok plus cos a, a means 2a then sin a. Now, when you use this sin 2a formula of your called to you and cos 2a formula then you will get everything in terms of this language that is displayed here sin 3a equals to 3 sin a, 3 sin a minus 4 sin qa. Ok, sin 3 angle formula. Now, formula number 6, formula number 6 that is cos 3a, cos 3a, cos 3a formula same, same rule will apply here, ok, cos 2a plus a use the same rule and you will get later on you will get this 4 cos 2a minus 3 cos a. And I am I have not derived this formula. I have kept upon left upon you to derive your tooth. Okay? Now seven also I will not derive. I will give you the hint and you must derive yourself, students, if you want to be challenged in this subject. Tan 3a. Let us write the formula. Then I will give you hint also. Tan 3a means tan 2a plus a. Now tell me which formula you will use here? This formula. Tan a plus b. Okay. 2a will be a, then this a will be b, then tan a plus b formula, tan a plus tan b by 1 minus tan a into tan b, means tan 2a plus tan a by 1 minus tan 2a into tan a, then you will get everything in terms of tan. So, this is the homework for you, you have to submit this by deriving the formula, ok. Now, let us go to eighth number formula that is quad 3a, similar process, quad 3a means quad 2a plus a. Now tell me which formula you will use? You will use this formula, ok. Now from here also you will get everything in terms of what and I have left it upon you. So as you derive it yourself. So students now some homework also at the end of this class I want to give you to please re revise this formula onto a class 9 and today multiple angle formula we have uh, understood here from 1 to 8 that formula you by heart and whatever I had said to derive this, this also you should know, ok, you try to derive, if you have any confusion you can comment in this video now, so I will see